Too, man, and from that intro, y'all saw, you know, I'm gonna give you some, I'm gonna give y'all some game and shit. You heard me? I'm gonna give y'all some game and shit, you know, on how to be successful in this retention shit. You heard me? You know what I'm saying and shit. We'll keep it a buck with you. The topic of the video is how to last at least 60 days or 90 days on retention. A lot of my subscribers been asking me, yo, bro, how you could go 330 days, bro, without busting, you heard me? And I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be honest with you, man. It's really, it's really simple. Just don't touch your meat, you heard me? Just don't beat the bitch, you know what I'm saying? I like to use that term, don't beat the bitch, because you know, when you're about to beat your meat, you're beating the chicken, you heard me? You know, you're beating, you're killing your shit, you know, watching another nigga fuck a bitch. You beating and shit to porn and shit, you know, beta male and shit. But yeah, man, let's get straight to it. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what you thought about the video. And I appreciate all the subscribers I've been gaining lately, man. It's crazy, because right now I have 666 subscribers, you heard me? You know, niggas might think it's the devil's number, but real talk, that's the spiritual number, you know. Yeah, man, let's get to it. The reason I could go a lot of days without busting this shit, don't mind my voice, man. I just woke up from a nap, nigga tired. But anyways, the reason a nigga could so many days without busting is cause, man, it's cause I be working like crazy, dog. I be putting 12 hours and 13 at my job, and this shit just be so crazy, bro. And I'm sorry if, if the shit is dark right now, you know what I'm saying? I got family members sleeping over, and you know, you know, when I turn on the light, that shit bright as a bitch. So, you know, that's just gonna have to deal with my face glowing for now, you heard me? So I could just spread the message. Well, the reason I could go a lot of days is just I've been working 13 hours, sit almost six days or seven days straight, cause you know, three people missing out my job and shit. And that's how I just been retaining my shit. And I've been dubbing females left and right, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got one of my ex, you want me to fuck her raw and shit. But you know what I'm saying? I'm not really into shorty like that. You know what I'm saying? When you be on the spiritual journey shit, you really just be like, you really just want to meet a soulmate, a girl that you will connect. Not some random girl in the streets, you know what I'm saying? It's just, it's different for me. I'm living like this now, bro. Like, like when you go through a spiritual awakening, you try to grow as much as you can and shit like that. So... What I'm trying to say is, man, get yourself busy, you know what I'm saying? Start working more, you know, don't stay home because once you stay home, temptation is coming. And even when I was staying home during the corona, temptation was hitting me hard, but my brain is so strong, dog. I always thought, what's the what's the point of me busting and getting this, this three-second pleasure, you know, dopamine rush? And then the next day, I feel like shit when I wake up. I don't feel mad tired, even though a nigga sleep like nine hours and shit, you heard me? What was the point? So, you know, you gotta have that mentality and shit in order to go 90 or 60 days, you know. To be honest, man, I have helped a lot of individuals and shit. I got a boy on Instagram saying he, he was thanking me and shit that he went 40 days because he never went 40 days without busting up. So, he been watching my YouTube. And he just started growing, you know. So yeah, man, that's that's the first step. Just keep yourself busy, eat healthy, take a lot of cold showers. They take, they drop your horniness down. That's what's true. What Anneli Chopper said, you hear me? They take your horniness down, bro. And here, man, it's just simple things like that. Work out, eat healthy, and yeah, man. And try to do as much meditation as you can. It eases the mind, and then release the stress. And when you release stress. And increase happiness and inner happiness. And when you enter, when you have inner happiness, you don't really want your vibration to lower because you're just in a good mood. You know, you're in a Zen mode. 
you know, yeah, you thugging. But yeah, man, you know, I wanted to make this video short and shit. I'll soon drop the 330 day video of Seymour Attention and shit. I know y'all niggas waiting for that bitch. But yeah, man, like this shit, comment, share it to one of y'all boys. It might help a nigga out one day, you know what I'm saying? Niggas going through shit nowadays with this pandemic. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, I look fucking different as fuck too. Like, on this retention shit, bro. Like, it's crazy, bro. Like, I'm talking to a girl right now that used to dub me back in the grip, you know what I'm saying? She talking to me now. She don't know I'm on this retention shit, though, but you know. It's just crazy how shit just switch, you know what I'm saying? And I'm planning on bigger things, man. I'm in Robin Hood investing money, son. I'ma soon drop a video on Robin Hood. Stay tuned for that, man. Get y'all free stocks up, lock, load up, man. Get y'all placements in. So in the future, when y'all be 30, y'all got a company paying you 500 bucks on that bitch. From just sleeping and doing nothing. You heard me?